guys and welcome to my channel hopefully you're doing productive and nice and today i'll be doing a paint with me type of video where i'm going to be painting a bottle probably haven't painted a bottle probably for like a couple months or so so today i'm going to be painting this glassy bottle you know it has a top bottle bottle top I actually have like a lot of these bottles. Um, I got like five of these bottles, including this one. So, um, um if you're watching this, I'm so sorry. But anywho, let's go ahead and begin this paint bottle. My design for this is going to be kind of like going to be like a butterfly theme. Like I want to paint a color and add some butterflies if I can. If I can do butterflies. So I hope this goes well. You can also see my progress through this, so let's get into it. Alright, I got my paint brushes. Um, I had to use paint brushes for a long time, especially those blue ones. That one I had just recently got and I'm too scared to use them because I don't want to mess them up. So next, I got a piece of paper so I won't ruin the good looking dresser. Got my Starbucks not sponsored bottle, of course. Also got my water. Only put a little bit of water because my paints are water based. So only put like a little teeny tiny, teeny tiny of water. And here is Mod Podge to seal it in so there's no scratches, no marks on it protectiveness you know you know what I mean and here are my paints now this is I think this is the only paints I have which is okay this literally lasts me like a year or so which one are you going to pick mix which one are you going to pick there's so many things to choose from which one that one no that one no that one which one which one to pick girl just pick one already just just pick one there you go that's a great color right there mooks and of course already got paint on my thumb wow great job all right and don't forget my palette you know I should really paint, try to paint that side. That'd be cool. I don't even know how that paint even got there in the back. I'm gonna shake up my paint and I'm going to start by of course um, taking that off, not sponsored. I just noticed that I still haven't used my new paint brushes. I haven't used them because like I said earlier I didn't want I did not want it to mess them up like I did to my um other paint brushes as you can see it still look like it has paint on them so I'm just gonna use my old one that I had for like probably two years might be even three years it still works well it's a it's a great brush I've been using it like literally all the time for this brush and sometimes I kind of like kind of break the brush kind of like bend it so it can be all flexible so it can like you know make smooth strokes here's my bottle I took the sticker off so I can actually paint on it and here is of course what y'all have been waiting for the close-up very satisfying mm. very satisfying i like doing these close-ups and putting that paintbrush in that paint is just really satisfying for artists all right my first stroke and of course, the first coating is always going to look, you know, 
a little see-through that's why you should put multiple coats I put at least probably three or four here is the coat that has been dried awesome I'm gonna put a second coat because it still looks see-through it needs to be solid no anything no see-through stuff by creating an imaginary picture This is the second coat of it drying as you can see it still looks splotchy so of course I need to put a second coating on this bottle Now here is the third coat dried. As you can see, there is still some splotchy splotchy again. This is where the point where I lost count um, of how many coats I put in. So I'm gonna put in my fourth coat in because I still don't like how it turned out. All right, so this is what it looks after the fourth coat. Um, there is that little splotchy thing. I'm going to definitely want to cover that up because um, no, I don't want to be seeing that. So I'm actually done coating. So now I'm going to actually add the butterflies. Here are the colors that I'm going to use. I'm going to put them down below also. So if y'all want to do this, y'all are very welcome to. And this is when I totally forgot what butterflies look like, so I literally had to search it up. What literally butterflies look like. So I spent like a good minute trying to figure out, try to look for a butterfly. <laughs> So now, right now, I'm putting dots, trying to make the butterflies as best as the ability that I can. And from now on, I'm going to let the music go without any interruptions. So, yeah. <laughs>